In this video, we will see how to unit test a behavior subject. So here in my Angular application, I have a source file where I am having a behavior subject called test name here. And in my component file, you can see that in the get in the get OBS method, I am subscribing to this particular behavior subject here. And whatever data I am getting, I am setting it onto this this data variable. So let's see how to unit test uh, a behavior subject. So we'll start by adding a test case here and I'll simply copy this code for creating an instance and a fixture so now I have a fixture here I have an app here so now next I need to create a service service reference to the this service dot service dot ts file so it's fixture dot debug element dot injector dot get service file now I need to call the app dot data get OBS method. Now, as you can see here, in this particular method, uh, we are simply subscribing to the behavior subject. So I'll do the same thing here. I'll simply make a call to the behavior to that get OBS function. And now, how do you validate this thing? So in order to validate this thing, this this uh, subscription needs to uh, this uh, behavior subject needs to get triggered. So we'll trigger it from here. Once you have made the call, or you, before you have made the call, you can do it either way because it's a behavior subject. So uh, you can be using the service reference, service dot test name dot next, and you can pass in some value here. Hello world. And once you have made the API call, you can expect app dot data variable. to be to equal hello world okay so now let's so I'll add the code coverage I'll run it with I'll run the unit test case with a minus code coverage option just to see the coverage of the code So here you can see the test cases ran successfully. Okay, now let's do the app folder. So I'll go here, coverage folder. So here it is, app, and the component dot ts. Here, as you can see, this whole method is absolutely fully covered. So it means it went all inside this thing. I hope you find this video useful. Uh, do let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Thanks for watching.